Hey guys, let's continue our discussion on uh, parts of computer uh, networks and uh, in this tutorial number 8 we will be discussing, uh, we will be exploring a simple office based network. And uh, let us suppose that uh, in an office we would like to share an internet connection. and it's a little older office so we have got modem and the modem is attached uh, to router our router has attached is attached to a server which has got hard disk so it is called a storage server. So all the office work is stored on this uh, server. And we have got uh, a printer attached to the server, a laser printer. Therefore, this server is also acting as a print server. So it's a print plus storage server. If you do not know what a server is, then you may think of a server as a very powerful device, a very powerful computer, which serves other computer in the network. So friends, uh, let's suppose our router is attached to a switch because it's an older network and we would like to explore different parts of computers networks therefore we have got a switch in our network diagram and then we have got two workstations you may think of a workstations as a simple computers but uh, they have less computing power and usually they use the computing power or the storage plus print services of the server. Therefore, we are, we uh, call them as workstations. They can be desktops, laptops, tablets, etc. So we call them workstations and they both are connected to a switch and our boss has got a laptop and he is connected to the network via router and he is using the Wi-Fi signals to connect to the server. So friends, we have already discussed that these, this laptop these workstations, this switch, this router, this modem, our server and our printer, they are all called as nodes. And this uh, copper cable through which our modem is connected to the internet this cable, copper cable, this copper cable, these Wi-Fi signals, this copper cable, they are all used for communication between different devices so that different devices can communicate with each other. Therefore, we call them communication media. And most of the people, when we talk about networking, they think of modems, routers, and switches. Switches also uh, uh, switches as uh, as uh, as the as the networking components, and they think that networking is all only uh, related to all only these components. But in this network diagram, we have seen that networking consists of network. Uh, simple network consists of nodes and communication medium plus these nodes uh, some of these nodes are used for networking therefore they are called let's suppose networking devices 
So friends, we have explored that a simple network consists of nodes, for example, workstations, computers, laptops, mobiles, tablets, and communication media, for example, Wi-Fi, wireless signal, microwaves, copper wire, etc. And they also consist of networking devices so uh, friends thank you very much for joining me for this tutorial see you in next tutorial uh, and please visit ifactner.com and subscribe to my channel take care bye